Tonight, four dogs in Walker County are in better circumstances, and now there are several warrants out for their owner. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Kim Chapman Whitfield. And I'm Josh Rowe. County authorities tell us they found three of those dogs trapped inside a vehicle. They found another dog nearby. Here's a picture of one of those animals. All were in need of serious help. Deputies say family members tried to contact the owner about the situation, but did not get anywhere. They say the owner's grandmother even tried to throw dog food into the vehicle to keep the animals alive. Fox Chattanooga's Mary Beth Mangrum sat down with animal control officials to learn more about this rescue. Typically, it isn't inside a car, especially for an extended period of time. Walker County authorities say three dogs spent around five days trapped inside a car. As you can imagine, being in there for such an extended period of time with lack of food and water, they were pretty much trying to eat on anything that they can. Their owner faces four counts of abandonment. It is our understanding she's not currently in Walker County, but we do have warrants issued. The incident report says that deputies with the Walker County Sheriff's Office were first on the scene after they received pictures of emaciated dogs trapped in a car with alarming conditions. Sections of the car had been chewed through. There was feces throughout the, the vehicle as well as urine. Um, maggots were in a lot of the floorboards, so the smell alone once you opened was, was pretty putrid. These pictures shared by the Walker County Sheriff's Office show the dogs inside the car, stuck in an environment the report describes as detrimental to their immediate safety and well-being. Officer Bailey Clements was one of the first to respond to the scene. She says the dogs showed visible signs of emaciation. So much weight has been lost that some muscle mass is starting to lose. Um, spine ribs, things like that are easily visible. It's a very obvious decrease in weight. The report says that no dog food was left or provided by the owner. Investigators found another dog close by, tied to a generator with little space to move, unhygienic surroundings, and no food or water near her. After their rescue, Officer Clements says authorities took the four dogs to the Walker County Animal Shelter. Before treatment, the report details a severe flea infestation that covered officers' arms, legs, and bodies when handling the dogs. Today, I think one of them is already pre-adopted, waiting on its home. Um, the main concern at that point that we were aware of um, is obviously the flea infestation on the animals as well as their weight but their health is improving. They got their vaccine, flea and tick, wormer. They were heartworm tested, um, weights and everything like that. In Walker County, Mary Beth Mangrum, Fox Chattanooga. And if you are interested in adopting one of those dogs, you can find a link by searching the story on our website, which is foxchattanooga.com.